Redgame.com, all the game you want and then some. So I never knew this day will actually come, but it's about time. It's about the damn time. Somebody, an investor who thought that EA and DICE could really bring a new end grading on the market with their Battlefield franchise, got fed up of this shit and <laughs> brought EA to the court. So the publisher EA and I think both DICE are now hit with a class A action lawsuit. It is about time and I'm going to congratulate who did this because it's not, not really out there but I'm glad they did this. Why? I don't know, have you played Battlefield 4? It's, it's not good. Let me put it that way, it's not good. The campaign sucks, but okay, let's let's skip the campaign. We, we won't talk about it because the campaign is not the main thing that Battlefield 4 has to offer. But since launch, the game has been quite difficult to play in the multiplayer mode because of several issues like crashes, like low latencies and, I don't know, bugs, glitches and every other thing you could think of. I don't know what's in their head, but this is wrong, man, and somebody needs to take action about this. Sorry about my phone. Somebody needs to take action about this and really uh, start making developers... Uh, oh my god, uh, sorry for a second, let me mute up my phone. So somebody needs to put some uh, some frighten into developers they need to start developing good game they need to start to give a shit about their customers because if you pay now sixty dollars you're just getting early access to battlefield 4 which which is a shame because the series has grown a lot in a short period of time it's one of the best series out there for fps is right on top with call of duty because those two are the titans but they every year releasing the same shit. They're releasing games that are not in any how near perfection. You need to get your games in line. I'm not saying the game is bad. The game, it's, oh, it's okay. Let's speak in general. The game is okay, but it will be much better if you sort your shit out and I don't know, fix those bugs because now it's unplayable. And if you pay sixty dollars, you will be you will be sorry for your money, and I'm sorry to say that. Okay, I will be reading you the statement or the lawsuit. What it's all about. The complaint alleges that during the class period, defendants issued materials, false and misleading statement highlighting the purpose, the purported strength of the company rollout of version four of its all important Battlefield video game series. Further alleges that on November 15, 2013, the day that Sony released this new PlayStation 4, it was disclosed that players of Electronic Arts games were being subject to multi multiple glitches and significant crashes when attempting to play at Electronic Arts titles on the PlayStation 4. So this is not just happening, happening on the current gen consoles. They're also uh, facing struggles on the PlayStation 4 and on Xbox One, I'm sure about that, even though they do not uh, state that in, uh, in the lawsuit subject. It's a shame because you, you have the crown, you have the title, you're on top two, let's say. We're not going to compare Call of Duty with Battlefield 4, okay? So they're both on, on the first place or both on the second place. I don't give a fuck about fans of both sides. So they're on top. They're on top, but they're screwing with us, and I don't think it's going to last any longer because shit, shit is getting real serious. If if investors are sick of sick of it, think of gamers who paid sixty dollars. Well, investors really give a lot more money than we give on a game, but they want to get something out of it. We are not getting anything but a game. They're getting money, so it's about time they did that, and. I'm sure hoping EA will lose this trial because they should do something about the games they're creating. They should care about the customers. They should care about the investors. So that was all for today, guys. Thank you for watching. And I'm, uh, I'm glad I'm doing this kind of vlogs about gaming, about news. 
and you seem to enjoy it as much as I do because I'm seeing a good uh, improvement in views and likes. So see you into the next one.